Yo, uh, what's going on guys? Uh, this is Sam Solomon here with the Story Breakdown Reflections, this time for the song Ill-Advised. I uh, hope you guys have listened to the song, uh, streamed it on all the streaming services or whatever streaming service that you have. It's available on, on all of them. Uh, but yeah, no, uh, Ill-Advised is another high energy song. It's very, very similar to the song that came before this, uh, I Told You So. Um, and yeah, it kind of reflects the, the feelings that I was feeling the, that that same energy that I had um, of 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 re like rebell that rebellious attitude of I'm um, I'm 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 following my dream and and I don't care if you don't you guys don't agree with me and you guys don't um, don't support me straight away I, like like I'm gonna show you I'm gonna I'm gonna I'm gonna I'm gonna prove you guys wrong um, what what like the backstory behind it is. Uh, I don't know how many of you guys listened to the story breakdown on reflection for told you so, but um, what happened when I when I when I decided to drop out of university? Uh, I actually um, uh, silly, it, like it, it's it's quite silly, but I I blocked everybody in my family uh, off of uh, all social media uh, or not not all all social media, all WhatsApp, all like all of their messages as well because. Um, I had I had all of this confidence uh, to to drop to that 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 gave me the confidence to drop out of university and 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 you and actually apply what I was uh, reading in the books that I was uh, reading like the, the especially the creativity follows commitment and and and, and burn the boats pretty much uh, with, with, with in terms of university, but my my family wouldn't see that and understandably my family wouldn't see that i was on a first class in engineering and i was right near the end and i was right about to graduate and i had a job lined up and that and i had a mentor and everything like that so so it really didn't really make sense at like it, it didn't really make logical sense in terms of um in terms of me trying to trying to trying to get rich which which as you guys will who who have listened to the story right now reflections for council or too old for this will know is something that I wanted for a long time. So it didn't really make sense in in that. And 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 even if I don't want to be rich, just in general, like like after working for all of that time, it doesn't really make sense. But um, as as I explained before, um, uh, I, I I I like after reading that book, um, the 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 be obsessed or be average, especially, but also the ten x rule uh, by Grant Cardone, and just uh, observing different things in my own life, like. Um, like me being able to expand my work ethic and 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 find possibilities much much more when when I, when I was forced to cram uh, in uh, like for exams or something like that. I genuinely believe that 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 phrase uh, creativity follows commitment, um, and 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 dropping out of university uh, like just was something that I could feel in my soul, <laughs> like I said in the Told You So song, that that was the right thing to do. But I, understandably, my family didn't really understand that. Um, so uh, what was happening was was my family were, were, were calling me, calling me, calling different people in my family, different people in my family, my very close family were calling me. And then I'd, I'd explain to them all the reasons, all these reasons that I'm saying now, um, that, that for you, <laughs> the person who's watching this, Whoever's watching this might think it is a little bit loony, uh, but but I was explaining, I was explaining all my full process, uh, and the more I would argue, uh, it wasn't I, I, it wasn't like a combative thing. It was like a genuine fear, like that 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 was starting to rise up in my in, in everybody in my family because that, because to them I seemed crazy. I seemed like I was having a meltdown, like I was having. Like I was going mad. Uh, like I say in the song, where I'm like, "Oh, I'm mad now. I've gone mad now. I really need to stop getting facts from the crack house, consuming books, trying to open up my mind." Uh, like, like I was reading these books, and and I was trying to, I was trying to. Um, if, if I'm being completely honest, I think I had a had a I, like. Obviously, I had a massive ego uh, as I kind of as 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 I kind of. Um, explain the root of it from from like the no games and and, and that kind of stuff it kind of shielded me um it kind of shielded me from 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 uh uh from different things from being hurt and stuff like that and uh, but but um w and and i think this this that massive ego uh like manifested itself in the fact that i was 
I was reading all of these success, different success books, success books, and since my family hadn't read the same books or achieved the same level of success as the people who, in the books that I was reading, I didn't really think I needed to. I didn't really think I. I, I kind of disregarded their their, their advice, uh, in as opposed to the, these books that I was reading, um, and. Obviously, I mean, there's positives and negatives to, to reading these books and stuff like that. Like, like, uh, like, um, th like, th so, 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 a, lo a lot. Obviously, these books are being written by people who who have genuinely, genuinely achieved the the the, the actual uh, things that like the money, success, and stuff like that that I'd like to. But um, with my family and reflection, what I'd say is my family um, that. They, they they genuinely cared for me um uh, and, and and they saw they 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 were they were right with me so you can have have these mentors from a book for that that are, that are, that are far away and just read giving you these books or you can have people who are around you and and observant and my family were even though they weren't living in the same I was living in Manchester they were living in London they were observant of of of, of, of my mental state and stuff like that and yeah like I was, I was, I was, I was, I was like, I'll, I'll admit it now, it seemed like I was having a, a, a mental breakdown, like, um, just, just the whole, the whole thing, um, block, uh, yeah, like, maybe, maybe not dropping out of university, but the, the block in my family, and then also, uh, what, uh, one thing that I spoke about, I think I spoke about this in the story, but in our reflections, we told you, so, I went from, uh, uh, Manchester, uh, through London to Leatherhead, to uh K to to the KBR the, the the internship that I did um over the summer uh, uh that I speak about in the song too old for this and I went through London even though my family live in London I didn't go home at all and I and I had my family brought, blocked uh people like my my sister was reaching out to my friend to get in touch with me and stuff like that and that was probably the most frightening day of my life that I've ever had in my life uh, because. Here, here I am making this massive sacrifice. Everyone thinks I'm cr like everyone thinks I'm crazy, which is starting to make me think like, am I actually going crazy? But I, I've made this decision now, um, and I, I, like I, I, I haven't, I, 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 I haven't handed in the work that I was supposed to hand in, and I'm applying like I, I'm doing. The, I've gone to the internship. Didn't tell anybody. By the way, that I was dropping out in the internship, um, they asked me to come back uh, like over the Easter break, and this was like a preliminary day, um, like just to understand what work I would be doing over the Easter. But but like I didn't, um, I didn't uh, uh, like yeah, I, I I didn't know what I was gonna do uh, in general. I was applying for so many jobs. I was I was yeah, that was probably the the scariest day of my life. Uh, and every time uh, someone would get through to me, I would have these arguments, and no one would seem to get it. And that's where the 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 emotion for ill advised came out. Um, it's like 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 um, I, I speak I speak about it. it's like uh, why do you not believe that that success can be achieved? Um, and I don't I don't I don't have to sleep to see my dreams, uh, and I can honestly uh, be everything I want to be. These are things that. I wanted to say to my family, I wanted to say to everybody, but I couldn't say because of obviously the seniority uh, is is a is a big thing in in Nigeria and especially African, uh, not African especially uh, all all fam like um, a lot, all families that I, I see, I I, I kind of see the seniority uh, thing, but especially African families and um, yeah Nigerian families. So I, so I couldn't really be rude and, and say these things like you guys don't understand. You guys just you guys are. Uh, uh, operating on the wrong information you guys are ill-advised is what is, is yes that that's where it was coming from um yeah and 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 it was like yeah it was just that 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 was that that kind of energy was stopping me from breaking down and 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 and, and like taking the taking the 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 the, the, the uh, like taking the drugs that i'd been offered in um, after speaking to some people, uh, uh, like I actually went to, so, uh, I haven't actually spoken about this yet, but I, during that period of time, um, 
I actually went to uh, to to counselor and stuff like that. Uh, when 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 I initially said that I was going to drop out of university, and this is what what I, I speak about this in the song "Grab It." If you, uh, if you guys are interested in listening to that song, you can find it on SoundCloud. In um, uh, yes, yeah, the first song on my SoundCloud. Uh, and, and, and I say uh, thought seeing a doctor would help, but she just said eat these pills. Uh, but I, I, I was just very opposed to that. I don't really want to go into that too much, but um, like like this, this kind of energy, this kind of uh, chip on my shoulder energy was 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 stopping me. Was the only thing that stopped me from from uh, really really breaking down, and uh, and it gave me the energy. I mean. What I'd say to anybody else who might be in that situation is, um, uh, you probably, you definitely don't have to be extreme as as, as I did, um, and uh, also it's it's best to understand that the people around you uh, love and care for you. Uh, if if they're if they're if uh, the the, the people like if they're genuinely trying to help and. Uh, with me, the pe- I, I know the people around me loved, loved and cared, cared for me, um, and blocking blocking people was definitely unnecessary. But I would I will say though uh, that s- with the people that that love and care for you, uh, they're gen- they're 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 automatically going to want what's they they're not going to want you to take massive risks. They're gonna they're gonna be automatic. They're obviously gonna be risk averse uh, because they don't want anything bad to happen to you. Uh, but when you're reaching for big goals, you're gonna have to you're gonna have to take big risks and stuff like that. So uh, it's a balance between being um, being appreciative of, of the love and, and having people around you for to to ca- catch you if you fall, but but balancing that with the 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 um, determination and the um, will to 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 go it alone and, and break out and 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 go and, and 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 go for a vision that only you see. So I mean, you have to make that choice. But um, in my in my in my uh, in my situation, I I, I I I went I went away on this side and 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 for a short period of time, cut off everybody. I, it wasn't that long, by the way. Um, like. Like uh, even though I didn't go home uh, off that that day when I went through uh, Le- to Leverhead through London to Leverhead, um, I didn't know. It's not like I caught off my family for for like long period of time. It was just like maybe I think it was, I don't think it was up to like a week. But um, that week and that that day after ha- making all these big decisions and being completely alone <laughs> was was like the f- most frightening uh, time of my life. But uh, I, I, yeah, yeah. Um, who who knows whether whether I'd have this this same work ethic that I have now if I didn't didn't make that decision. So I don't know. I'm not. I, I, I'm. If you're if you're thinking of drop it, dropping out, I'm not saying that you should do that or anything like that. And I and I can't really give specific advice to people. Uh, but what I I I just reiterate what I said earlier is uh, uh, it's it's amazing to have have people who love and care for you and and and, and I, right now I'm I'm, I'm mad appreciative. Of, and and I cherish it so much, but I still understand that um, the people around me uh, who who love and care for me, uh, and the people around the people you who, whoever's watching this who love and care for you are gonna want you to uh, avoid risk uh, because they want you to they they, they they don't want anything bad to happen to you. But if you're really trying to go for the dream that you're going for, uh, you're gonna have to take risks. So. Um, and you're gonna have to uh, feel alone sometimes. Uh, and if you're going for the really big risk, if you're anything like me, then you're gonna you're gonna have to deal with people thinking you you're you're crazy sometimes. But um, yeah, uh, the uh, arguing with arguing arguing your point generally doesn't really work. Uh, actions of uh, actions and 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 being quiet and 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 just making progress uh, is for me is what I've found to be the most effective uh like in reflection uh but yeah hope you guys enjoy the song uh look out for dream time coming up next i think you guys i think you guys i think you guys will like that song that's a bit more a bit more light-hearted and, and 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 a bit more happy 
happy. But I uh, hope you guys have a great week. Uh, thank you so much for listening to the song. It's out on all streaming services. Hit me up on Instagram if you'd like to chat further or, or be down in the comments, actually. Uh, yeah, let me know what you guys think of the song and the story and the story and everything like that down in the comments. Peace out, guys.